Hello, and welcome to the pre-admission clinic, or PAC. PAC is the place where you will find out what you need to do to get ready for your surgery. This is an appointment or a call that will happen before your surgery, and I'm here to tell you all about it. The hospital will call you to let you know when your pre-admission appointment or call is scheduled before surgery. Not all patients need an in-person PAC visit. A nurse will let you know if you need to come to PAC for an appointment or if you will be asked to give information to a nurse over the phone. If you don't have to come to PAC before your surgery, you'll have a PAC call. A nurse will ask you about your health, check and update your address and phone number, Alberta Health Care number and emergency contacts. Explain how to get ready for surgery. You may get instructions and more information about your surgery in the mail. Send you a form to have blood tests or tests done if you need them. Offer you a group session if there's one near you. If you have to come to PAC for a visit, you will Meet with a nurse who will explain how to get ready for your surgery and what to expect while you're in the hospital. Check and update your address and phone number, Alberta Health Care number, and emergency contacts. Have blood tests done if you need them. You may also have an ECG, heart tracing, or other tests that your surgeon wants done before your surgery. Meet with an anesthesiologist to talk about your anesthesia plan and options for pain relief, sign consent forms or other forms. You'll be asked to bring all prescriptions and over-the-counter medicines, vitamins, supplements and herbal products you take. The doctor will tell you what medicine to stop taking before your surgery and when to stop taking it. If you have an advanced directive or a living will, bring a copy with you for your medical record. The PAC nurse will give you information to take home with you if you haven't already been given it by your surgeon. If you had a PAC call, you'll get a packet in the mail. It will tell you all about the hospital, a map, and where to park, how to get ready for your surgery, eating and drinking before surgery, what to bring to hospital and what to leave at home, other information relevant to your surgery. You'll also get directions to the department or unit where you need to go on the day of your surgery. After you've had your PAC call or visit and the paperwork is out of the way, you can focus on getting yourself ready for your surgery. I hope this information has been helpful.